Eivor, welcome to the West Market. A lawman like you could set folks on edge in a square like this. Why not wear a cloak? Hide my face? Not a chance. It does the people good to see a lawman on the hunt. And once we've found the arrow, this order needs to know we'll be after the leech and the compass as well. The noise yet about the arrow and recruits? I've heard whispers. Somewhere here, a man gives you a coin. And this coin grants you entry to a contest run by the Arrow's men. Which man? I see too many here. He's good at blending in. I haven't spotted him yet today. I will sniff around. You stay back. Eivor! What was your impression of Erke? You know him better than me. If you suspect him, only say the word. No. No, I, I believe in Erke. It's me I don't trust. I feel unfit for my post some days. Ah, forgive me. My latest thoughts have been restless. I've been a Reeve for so long. Fighting for God's justice. I shed my earthly attachments for his great plans. But, but you could not shed Erke and his friendship. No. No, I'm not sure I could. I should find one of these coins soon. Will you be around? I'll return to St. Paul's just down the road. Godspeed, Eivor. Hey! Follow me to the casks! Don't mind if I... You got the coin? You have had enough, me, friend. Is that the coin? For the archery contest? Keep off the rail. This is my coin. I saw it. You want one? You talk to my mate Husha, and he'll point you through. We heard the take for this job is three stumps of silver a month. Is that true? No. And they pay you more if you drive your brothers into it. Hus has earned a fortune skimming the docks of London. Oh, he goes by the arrow, I'm told. Fit name for a keen archer. Can't wait to meet the man himself. About time someone did something about those filthy outlanders ruining our city. Aye, fucking pond scum. Coming here with their hands out. London for Londoners. Vermin stay on the other side of the wall.
What's your business? Shooting or watching? You are looking for skilled archers. Now you have found one. This contest is private. Invitation only. Your men are handing out these coins like they were on fire. Is this enough? It's enough to keep us talking. But I'll want to see how well you handle that bow before you go any further. Want a trial round to test your eye? I will shoot a practice round, just to be sure. Go ahead then. They're all set up. How was that? You've got quite an eagle eye on you. I've had enough practice. Let us begin. A real fanatic you are. Get ready. It's a simple contest here. Hit all targets true before the sand runs down. Here's a new competitor. A Norse from the northern wilds of Mercia. And our current reigning champion, Seyed! All right, take your marks. Hook set! Arrows north! A cheat! It was a fair shot! Carry on! Holding spear! Eivor leads to victory! That's deadly aim you have. Best I've seen for some time. Well shot! You have earned your place at the Arrow's side today. He'll be eager to meet you. Hold yourself to the Imperial Arch and speak with our man, Hussa. Recite the phrase. May the Father of Understanding guide us. And he'll know it's you. Are you Husa? Yeah. And who's asking? May the Father of Understanding guide us. And may the Mother of Wisdom give us strength. You're to stand just there, 
Look your best when the arrow comes forth and keep still. Friends, brethren, good people of London, we have had a hard week. Cowardly invaders stole into our governor's home and robbed him of his life. Trigger, my friend, my leader, slaughtered like a dog by outsiders, by the... It's a hard thing to raise the rats of a city into warriors. Hook set! You raised no one. You only trapped them in their cowering fear. Draw strings! First wave fire! No. I gave these men order. I gave them purpose. I showed them their common enemy. Anchor strings! Second wave fire! I was arrow for their rage. Without a foe to consume, we devour ourselves. He speaks true. A man without an enemy defeats himself. Justify all you want. You're just a king killer and a coward. Mighty high horse, you'd do the same if you were me. Aim and fire! You're unharmed. Praise be to God. It will take more than a few lads with newly polished bows to fell me. The arrow was a boy. A man with a boy's brain called Avgus. Avgus? I can't be right. I could return with his head on a spear if you would like to see. No. You've no reason to lie. Yet Avgus, my old friend, had no cause to murder. He saw London as a kiln of rage. To harden the softness of its younger men. Perhaps I ignored in him what I hoped not to see. Ambition. Greed. Anger. 
From one man, such hatred is easy to spot. But from many, it is a fog that fills the room. Power. Men will claw for it and cling to it at the cost of everything. Very true. And it is cold comfort, but glory has the taste of your family's blood. With Avgo's gone, I will turn my attention to the leech. Herkes should be down at the Keys. He'll be waiting for you. If the compass should emerge, we will let you know. Then I'll be at St. Paul's Church, waiting for the good word. Take care, Broga. <laughs>